follows at 5.30. We have new information tonight about a Freeman High School graduate who died after being hit by a car. Thank you for being here with us. I'm Lorenzo Hall. And I'm Julie Bragg. We knew earlier this week that 21-year-old Trayvon Mayfield was hit by a car on Mountain Road in Glen Allen. What we learned today is that Martin fell out of a truck and then he was hit by a car. And police still haven't found the truck. CBS 6's Sandra Jones spoke to Mayfield's friends about this new information. Sandra? Julie, close friends of Trayvon Mayfield are heartbroken and confused over this latest news. They want the driver of that pickup truck to come forward and help bring closure to a case that's touched an entire community. It still doesn't feel real. The pain of losing a close friend is still very raw for Jonathan Phillips. He was an amazing person. He was kind-hearted. He was a great guy. He's always someone you wanted around. He's just always smiling and joking. But that joy turned into deep sadness for Phillips following the tragic death of Trayvon Mayfield. Police say a woman driving a Nissan Maxima here along Mountain Road Saturday night ran over the 21-year-old. Detectives found his body lying in the middle of the street. Mayfield died on Tuesday. His friends tell CBS 6 he left a party before the fatal accident, but the circumstances surrounding his death are unclear. Police now believe Mayfield may have fallen into the roadway while riding in the back of a pickup truck, moments before he was struck by the car. But they have not released the details as to why. Do you think it may have been intentional? I really hope not. I don't know anybody who would have wanted to do that to him. Nobody I've ever met around him had any type of dislike for him like that. While friends remember the Freeman High School grad, police are searching for that pickup truck and the driver. And Jonathan Phillips wants to... Just hopefully that they speak up. I don't know why they wouldn't just come forward and just tell what they know about what happened. Now, Trayvon's friends tell CBS 6 he lost his mom to cancer earlier this year. And many years ago, his father died in a car crash. His friends have started a GoFundMe account to help with funeral expenses. If you have any information about the pickup truck or the driver involved in that incident, call Crime Stoppers at 780-1000. I'm Sandra Jones, CBS 6 News.